Hi you guys, it's Mrs. C and I've got some stories for you today. Our first one is by Candace Fleming and G. Brian Carers. Muncha, muncha, muncha. Muncha, muncha, muncha. For years, Mr. McGreeley dreamed of planting a garden. He dreamed of getting his hands dirty, of growing yummy vegetables, and of gobbling them all up. But he never once tried until this spring, said Mr. Greeley. This spring, by golly, I'm going to plant a garden. So he hoed and he sowed and he watched his garden grow. Lettuce, carrots, peas, tomatoes. Yum, yum, yummy, said Mr. Greeley. I'll soon fill my tummy with crisp, fresh veggies. But one night when the sun went down and the moon came up, three hungry bunnies appeared. Tippy, 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 pat. Muncha, muncha, muncha. The next morning, when Mr. McGreeley saw his gnawed sprouts, he was angry. So he built a small wire fence all around his vegetable garden. There, he declared, no bunny can get into my garden now. And the sun went down and the moon came up and tippy, 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 pat. Spring hurdle, dash, dash, dash. Muncha, muncha, muncha. The next morning, when Mr. McGreeley saw his nibbled leaves and gnawed sprouts, he was really angry. So he built a tall wooden wall behind the small wire fence all around his vegetable garden. Humph, he humph. Those flop ears will never get over it. No bunny can get into my garden now. But, and the sun went down and the moon came up and tippy, 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 pat. Dig, scrabble, scratch, scratch, scratch. Spring hurdle, dash, dash, dash. Muncha, muncha, muncha. The next morning, when Mr. McGreeley saw his stewed, chewed stems, his nibbled leaves, and his gnawed sprouts, he was really, really angry. So he made a deep, wet trench outside the tall wooden wall, behind the small wire fence, all around his vegetable garden. Ha! He snorted. Those puff tails can't get under it. They can't get over it. No bunny can get into my garden now. And the sun went down and the moon came up and tippy, 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 pat. Dive paddle, splash, splash, splash. Dig, scrabble, scratch, scratch, scratch. Spring hurdle, dash, dash, dash. Muncha, muncha, muncha. The next morning, when Mr. McGreeley saw his chomped blossoms, his chewed stems, his nibbled leaves, and his gnawed sprouts, he was furious. So he hammered and blocked, sawed and stalked, drilled and filled and trapped and locked. And he built a huge, enormous thing before the deep, wet trench outside the tall wooden wall, behind the small wire fence, all around his vegetable garden. I've outsmarted those twitch whiskers for sure, he exclaimed. They can't get through it, they can't get under it, and they can't get over it. No bunny, no way, no how can get into my vegetable garden now. And the sun went down and the moon came up and tippy, 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 stop. The three hungry bunnies looked and smelled and touched the huge, enormous thing before them and tippy, 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 pat. The bunnies hopped away. The next morning, when Mr. McGreeley saw his untouched vegetables, he was happy. I beat the bunnies, he whooped and did a jiggly wiggly victory dance. Then he climbed over, jumped across, squeezed between, and crawled under until he reached his vegetable garden. Ah, sighed Mr. McGreeley. At last, smacking his lips, he picked and pulled up lettuce, carrots, peas, tomatoes, and with his basket overflowing, he reached inside for something yummy. <gasps> muncha, muncha, muncha. This is Norman, by the way. So I know we've been studying animals lately, so we do have a nonfiction book. This is called Wombats, which happens to be my sister's favorite animal. Wombats are marsupials. They have round bodies and short legs. Females have pouches on their bellies. The pouches keep joeys warm. A joey climbs into its mother's pouch after birth. Soon it grows too big for the pouch. Wombats live in forests and dry grasslands. They rest in burrows during the day. 
strong legs and wide feet help them dig burrows. Wombats graze when the sun goes down. They eat grasses, roots, and tree bark. They gnaw on their food. This keeps their sharp teeth short. Wombats run from dingoes, foxes, and other predators. They dive into their burrows. Then they block the tunnels with their bodies. And then at the end of all these books, as you know, there's some glossary. And so burrows, just for review, holes or tunnels that some animals dig in the ground, gnaw to bite or chew on something to wear it down, graze to eat grasses and other plants, joeys, baby marsupials, marsupials, animals that carry their young in a pouch attached to the belly, pouches, pockets of skin on the bellies of female marsupials, predators, animals that hunt other animals for food, roots, the parts of plants that grow into the ground. So I hope you enjoyed that. See you soon.